Mind your decisions, I'm Presh Tilwalker. There are three rectangles placed in a row. The width of the first and second rectangles together is equal to 7 meters. The width of the second and third rectangles together is equal to 8 meters. If the first rectangle has an area equal to 20 square meters, and the third rectangle has an area equal to 25 square meters, what is the area of the second rectangle? Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. So how can we solve this problem? For ease of presentation, let's focus on just the numbers and I'll remove the units. Suppose the second rectangle has a width equal to x. We can then calculate the width of the first rectangle in terms of x and it will be equal to 7 minus x. We can also do this for the third rectangle, so its width is equal to 8 minus x. Now suppose all three rectangles have a common height that's equal to y. We can calculate the area of the first rectangle in terms of x and y. 7 minus x multiplied by y will be equal to the area, which is equal to 20. We can do a similar calculation for the third rectangle. Its area is equal to 25, and that will be equal to 8 minus x multiplied by y. Finally, we can calculate the area of the second rectangle in terms of x and y. Its area will be equal to x multiplied by y. We now have three equations for areas of these rectangles. We can use these equations to solve for x and y. We will first distribute y in the first equation, then we will distribute y in the second equation. From these two equations, let's subtract the second equation from the first. The xy terms will cancel, leaving that y is equal to 5. From here, we can go back to the first equation and substitute in for y. We will then solve for x. We will get that x is equal to 8 minus 5, which is equal to 3. We then substitute in to the area of the second rectangle, which is equal to x multiplied by y, and we get the area of the second rectangle is equal to 15. And don't forget the square meters. The area of the second rectangle is equal to 15 square meters. And that's the answer. Thanks for making us one of the best communities on YouTube. See you next episode of Mind Your Decisions, where we solve the world's problems one video at a time.